so Rose Warren, uh, it's, our, it's the district's only operating landfill right now. We have 33 closed landfills across the district, but it's the only place that's actually receiving garbage. Um, right now, we're sort of forecasting that Rose Warren will be out of capacity by 2036. And so it sounds like it's a long time away, but it takes a really long time to get a new facility online, get the approvals. And really, a lot of communities don't want another landfill in their neighborhood. And so it's sort of managing that. And the idea here is to get to 60% so that we can stretch the capacity as long as possible so that we don't have to create another landfill operation. Um, it'll save the taxpayers money ultimately because it's very expensive, but also getting putting the right materials in the right place allows us to make good environmental choices as well. Part of diverting a lot of the waste from that landfill is by making it easier to recycle as the district has now removed the need to separate recyclables. Um, historically we had folks separate their recycling from blue bin to gray bin and, and keeping up paper out of the cycle, recycling stream. We have a new contract with, uh, with our contractor in North York and what they have is advanced processing that allows them to take all the conglomerated material and then separate that with uh, artificial intelligence and, and high technology sensors that they can pull that out. So we don't need folks to do that for them and then they do it again at the, at the plant. So not only does it help folks uh, make recycling a little bit easier for them, but it also produces very little residual in the end. So they're able to collect every little bit of uh, resource from that uh, recycling material.